we are MindFlow. And our story begins now. Birth of Mindflow actually began as a piano trio. And it's one of those stories where we all met and everything just kind of clicked. We met in Boston while studying at the Berklee College of Music. And during this time, we would not only constantly play together, but we would rehearse, even if we didn't have a show. That's just the kind of dedication and focus that we had, all while building this strong friendship that's lasted throughout the years. When Simon came to Boston a little later on and started playing with us, Again, it was that instant connection and the start of something special. He really added his own unique voice and that extra layer to the music that took it to a new place. What we want people to understand about us is that we are MindFlow. It's never been about individual instruments or personalities. It's one unit, and we all move together and flow together. I feel like it's rare these days to come across bands like this, and it mostly just seems to be about one leader. But for us, we love doing what we do, and we love doing it together. Heritage is something that's very important to all of us, and we often get asked about where we're all from. It's crazy to think between the four of us, we have India, France, Trinidad, Hungary, and Canada. And the amazing thing about this diversity is that we have this never-ending pool of inspiration to draw from. To us, one of the most beautiful things about creating music is digging into those roots and incorporating elements of your own culture within the music. Something that we always aim to achieve within our music is this idea or interpretation of what we call flow. To us, flow is this feeling where everything kind of fits into place, allowing for this sense of seamlessness and being fully immersed in the music. Aside from music, flow is all around us. It's in our everyday lives. There's flow in the way you dress. There's flow in the way you speak. It's in the mind. And this is something that's not always easy to put into words, but you know when it's there. And it's almost always present when the four of us come together. There was this one performance that we had in Brooklyn a few years back that we always kind of come back to when thinking about what that defining moment was. Long story short, by the end of the night, we all just kind of looked at each other. And without actually saying anything, we all knew. This is what it's supposed to feel like. This is what it's supposed to sound like. The energy and flow of things was really unlike anything we'd experienced as a band before. I remember on the car ride back, Shark was telling us about this out-of-body experience that he had, and that at one point he felt like a spectator during our own show. Of course, we were all laughing at him at that moment, but at the same time, that was when we realized we need to record this album. The name of this album, From Time, really just touches on the time that we've all known each other. You know, we've known each other from time, we've been brothers from time, and we've been creating music together from time. It also relates to how we all believe that now is the time to make all of this really happen. To take the risk and just dive in. Ultimately, our main goal as a band is to really just break down the walls of whatever frame of mind someone might be in 
invite them to be in the moment with us and just let their mind flow. Ooh, that sounds nice.